Good morning and howdy good evening. And I've got Rokatsuki on Hermes with his Brandenburg with teammates Lexington, Kansas, Odin, Shrill, Blurious, and uh, Pensacola. The chair six is going to have some issue. Uh, Shrill, we'll see how he does. Odin doesn't have really helpful, so really the only hard hitting hitters are Odin and Kansas. So there is that. So we do have to, you know, worry about that. So we'll see what goes on. close uh, they do make it okay great Lexington planes just get it just in time Spurgeon doesn't favor him on that, but they are getting within their secondary range. The Pensacola's... Oh, Pensacola, please don't go there. If he goes any further, he's going to trigger the battleship. And they don't have the kind of firepower on this map to really take with them. And I think Pensacola's going to trigger the battleship if he keeps going that way. So well, that's not a good sign. Like, that's getting extremely close to the no go zone. And he triggered the battleship. Oh boy. Well, a good job getting the Citadel on the Nuremberg. That's a problem. That's. A, I mean, Pitch Cole is going down. He's dead. That made this op just a lot harder. Even though I wanted to spawn camp the battleships and kill them all, I don't do that. Because if that's what happens, I mean, you'd probably need triple Kageros just to do it. And there goes the Pimsy. Even Rokatsuki's like, why are you spawn the battleships early? I mean, you guys have all seen me do it in, the, in a vanguard. Rokatsuki gets the honor of being in a secondary battleship, so he's going to have an easier time than I did. Although he's all alone. I think I had Volrom with me that time. Although they are doing a significantly better job than my team did. Shrill is pretty low health. How low is the Kansas? He, he looked pretty low when we last saw him. There goes Luchin, so that will help him a lot. That's gonna help 
get his damage up higher. And significant. Oh wow, Kansas is almost dead. Shrill, I don't know how long Shrill's gonna live out there like that. And yeah, that I was afraid that would happen. So they're either gonna shoot. Odin or Kansas? My gut says Odin. The good news is there's only t well, there is still three of them, and there's a full health turrets back there, which I think there's a turrets back there. Oh wait, maybe it's just a bear and the shark horse. I could have no, there's a third one back there. Yeah, there's a turrets back there. I thought there was a turrets back there. Odin, I don't know if that was worth it, buddy. Losing that much health. So, we'll see how long Odin lasts. The Torps might hit something, but he's going to lose a lot of health. The Torps don't look to hit. Yeah, he's going to get one on the bow. Uh, Turpid. Okay. Doesn't cause a flood, though. He must have DCP'd it. So, that's unfortunate. So now the only one in the direction that's probably gonna take all the fire is the campus. And they're like, that jackass really fucked us. Yep. That would be Odin and uh CB. It's interesting though, because I've rarely, I've been playing Ops for a long time. Especially since they re -came, came out again. And it is rare to see a spawn, early spawn of battleships. This is the, I'm only, this is the closest I've seen it in recent months. It used to be like an unsung rule that nobody would, you know, go and get the battleship, trigger the battleships. It does look like Kansas is going to live. So that is good. They will need his big gun. Well, for a tier 6 and an 8 loss, that's a pretty hard uh, um it's a tough one. Oh, those might hurt. Oh, good. Oh, they were going for the Odin. That was lucky. Rokatsuki did get lucky, though, that those bombs didn't hit his center mass. Um, well, those bombs were right on top of him. Kansas is not going to be full health. He's not going to get full health by the time he leaves that circle. He's too damaged. So he's going to be at least two-thirds health by the time he leaves. So he is going to have to play carefully. Same with Odin. He won't be full health. So the best battleship they have now is Brandenburg at full health. has been destroyed. But that is a lot of points. That was lucky that those torques didn't arm. I am... I feel like their meat shields are going to be... They're gonna, these meat shields here are going to take some pretty good pounding, so... 
Yep, there's one, two torps on that one. So, looks like St. Louis is almost dead. I don't know how long uh, Charles is going to live. But St. Louis does have a flood on him. And Baron will probably shoot him. So, we gonna, so we're probably going to rule off the St. Louis. Yep, there's the shots. Yep, there goes the St. Louis. Knew it. More torps coming in. Those are aimed at Charles and I think Brandenburg. It did hit something. I think it hit the Charles. Picks it up on a secondary kill, nice. I mean, that meat shield is still fairly full of health. It'll, it'll buy time. I don't know about those planes, though. I mean, in terms of AA ships, the best ship they have is Kansas. Kansas, you know, is so badly damaged. The good news is, looks like Cap City is being the meat shield now. He's gonna take those torps though. You can only dodge so many torps. Looks like two, maybe three. Barely three. He got lucky on the bow torp. Those armor-piercing bombs are gonna hurt. They get a little Katsuki, they will hurt. Hopefully they go for Charo. Oh, he took some hits, that's for sure. Missed those ones. Another wave, there's the bombs. And I have absolutely no idea if those hit. A lot of bombers. Yep, okay. He was definitely taking some of those armor piercing bombs. Now, Katsuki's gonna be taking all the armor piercing bombs if there is anything left. I don't know why he hasn't switched to HG yet. I, 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 I don't really get that. Oh, it looks like he's fortunate that they've used all their bombs up on the Charles. That he doesn't get anything, which is probably a good thing. Okay, there's the HG. He, he, yeah, he got lucky on that one. We sunk an enemy destroyer. Go for the back one, go for the back one. Nice. He needs to get the even if Ruan, uh, he's got to get it down or at least knock out some of those torp tubes. Okay, great. The DD's gone. Doesn't look like they dropped torps. And there's still some bombers out there. Come on, Cam. Just get those guns in use. It's possible they got to get more fire on that thing, but they can get a five star. Possible. 
With everything going in, every shot, he gets a little bit closer. But I don't... How Ruan is getting free, he's gonna be leaving the circle here. Come on, Kansas. Come on, Odin. That's a permanent fire. He gets it. Nice! Five stars. Beautiful. Just before he crosses. That was a, I would say, a good team effort. But a slight carry from Col from Rolcat. So. But a really decent game. At almost 300k. 40 plane kills. That's pretty, that's, that's a decent amount in a battleship. Looks like he made over a million credits. Decent amount of free XP at almost 6,200. C star assistant. Let's see. Yeah, that was a carry. That was a hard carry. Him and the Odin did pretty well, though. Same with the Kansas. Kansas did... The, the top four did really well, considering that Kansas did get meat... Was a meat... Was a pretty much a big meat shield, but his AA did come into effect, and he helped shoot down some planes. So, he did his work. But 23-25, that's a really good score. A good portion of that I know was from DD damage. Like those three DDs he had at the very end probably is what got him up so high. But in terms of, oddly enough, it was pretty much the secondaries and main batteries on that. Oddly enough, he got three fires on it. That was a close one on that one. But it was a very great comeback for sure. Because the, when the Pinsy triggered those battleships, uh, I honestly, my hope kind of went boom. I've been there. I've done that. It's not fun. Unfortunately, he doesn't have premium. So that would have been over a million and a half credits. And over 10,000 free XP. And... With the commander, 21 points. Uh, it would have been a nice, not as big haul as free commander XP, but uh, but everything else would have been a very beautiful uh, XP haul. What was he running anyway? He was running a red booster, so that would have been a great thing with our with a um, blah 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 uh, with a premium account. But he did a phenomenal job. That was a great game. That was a really good carry and a great comeback from. What had happened? And I will be attaching his build at the end of the video.